tell you if it'd be you this week? Uh, I think that's a better question for Coach Kiffin. You know, he kind of just told us going into this week to just be ready and prepare like we'd be the starter. So it's kind of just the approach I took and, and uh, you know, I just expected to play. So, um, yeah, just try to be prepared this week. He said he saw a little bit more from you in practice, some speed-wise getting used to tackles. How have you kind of acclimated to that this, this early in the season? Yeah, I would just think, like, the more time that I've had um, just being in the offense and just learning – the whole schematics of it all, you start to pick up on things faster. And um, the more you're in it, you start to play without hesi any hesitation. So um, I would just say the biggest thing has just been reps. And you had that interception right before halftime and you come out in the three straight touchdown drive. How big was that for you, just confidence-wise? Yeah. Um, you know, I thought I played really good up until until that point. And, uh, you know, I just you know told myself that, you know, I'm going to make a mistake. Um, I think the biggest thing is just how I respond. And uh, so, you know, I was just trying to do all, all that I can to do my part from, from then on and try not to do too much to take what the defense was giving me and respond to each and every drive. Can you take us through that third down uh, run where you trust the guy? Yeah, uh, yeah I think <laughs> I feel great. Um, I heard Coach Kiffin uh, or someone tell me to stay in bounds and try to get the first down. And, you know, that was already my mentality anyway. So, um, you know, I just tried to do all I can to get the first down. Is that the first time you've ever done that? No. <laughs> no. Uh, that first draw that you ran. Uh, I'm, I'm really confident in it. I feel like a lot of people weren't able to see it for me last year just because I had a torn meniscus and, uh, you know, <laughs> a messed up MCL. So I was kind of limited on things that I couldn't do. But, um, you know, I, I feel really confident in my, in my running abilities. Um, you know, I just got to keep on working. I'm getting in shape because it's tiring sometimes. So uh, I just got to keep pushing through it. When you do have a run like that where you, where you trust a guy and everybody gets excited, I mean, can you, can you, does the offense feel that? Yeah, I would, you know, absolutely. I know for me, when I see somebody on our team, you know, truck someone, it gets me all juiced up. So, um, you know, I think that just kind of how the situation played out, I was trying to just do all that I can. And, um, you know, you do something like that, a lot of people get excited. 316 yards, you know, on the team, on the ground. I mean, just what else can you say? Just stop this rushing attack. I, we got the best rushing attack in the country. We got, you know, some of the best backs. We got the best O line. And, uh, you know, I think that's just, you know, our, our offense is on the O line shoulders. And when we can go into a place and completely dominate them at the line of scrimmage, you know, I, we feel very, very confident in winning the game. And, um, you know, Coach Kiff and all the coaches told us to bring our run game, and that's what we did. Has there been a part of a football game where there have been zero passing touchdowns and six rushing touchdowns? Especially not, not in a while. Not in a while. Um, in, in high school, for my first three years, I kind of played in a wing T offense. So <laughs> that kind of played out uh, somewhat similar. But, you know, you're just really excited to win the game. And uh, you know, I'm just super happy for, for the guys and for all the successes that they were able to have today. Do you do separate line dinners from Zach, or do you guys chip in together? Uh, <laughs> it's kind of just like uh, both of us kind of will chip in and take turns. So, you know, I promised the line I'd take in the grill house. So, you know, I'm sure that's going to be a little bit of pretty penny, but they deserve it. <laughs> How have you kind of acclimated to the really up tempo style in this offense? And you know, with no huddle, obviously you've got to have that playbook in the back of your head at all times. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you know, it's it's what it, what's a huge driving force for our offense and what sets us apart. And uh, you know, I think for me, like, I'm, I I had to learn it. I had to learn it as fast as I can, so I can be able to you know make the calls that I need to make and be able to uh, you know get everybody lined up so we can have that tempo advantage. And uh, yeah, so it's kind of it's a requirement. So you kind of just lean into it and do all that you can to to pick up on everything. Last one. Thank you, guys. Thank you.